Well, I am very excited. We have some pretty great people here. You see them. They're all holding guitars. They're holding mics. You know what's coming. It's a night of live music showcasing local country artists, and it's all for a good cause. We have Zach on the end here with us. We have Brianna and Annabelle as well joining us. Thank you, everyone, for coming on our show today. Yes, thank you for having us. Yeah, we are very excited, and we are going to hear them sing in just a minute. But first, we're here to talk about the Grand Old Brewery event and so why don't we start with you on the end there can you just kind of explain what that event is yeah so we have uh, so much talent here in the fargo moorhead area that we we're kind of sitting there me travis hopkins and uh and the crew over at jade presents we're kind of looking and we're like you know why don't we, we there's all these showcases down in nashville why don't we do something like that up here we have we have plenty of talent and so we, we came up with the grand old brewery idea that is awesome and so where is it going to be it's gonna be at fargo brewing company at the hall yeah. And on uh, what to, coming up here, what day? March 4th. And, uh, I believe doors open at 6. March 4th, doors open at 6. Okay. And so then uh, if you want to just talk, what's it like for you to be able to perform in, uh, in this type of a showcase? Like you said, normally it's in Nashville, but bring in a little bit of that up here to Fargo. Yeah, honestly, it's amazing. Like, like Zach was saying, like in Nashville, there's so much of this. And especially lately, thanks to, you know, Jay Presents and Travis and everything, like there's been a lot more opportunity for like songwriters nights and sharing our originals and not just, you know, songs by other people. So it's been awesome. Yeah, and so for you, uh, not to give anything away, she is the youngest person here. How old are you again? I'm 15. 15 years old. Can you, you can legally drive though, right? Is yeah. that, okay, in North Dakota anyway. <laughs> yeah. In Minnesota, you just have your permit. Uh, but what's it like for you being so young and in something like this? Um, well, it's definitely really nerve wracking, but it's also, I also know that I'm really lucky to get to do this at a young age. Um, and it's just, an, it's an honor to work with a lot of great songwriters and to meet them and talk with them about what we're doing. And to continue to just grow yeah. your craft and your talent, yeah. and that is awesome. And so now we're going to kind of just brag a little bit about all the talent that we have here in Fargo. So why don't you talk about some of the people you've performed with or where yeah. people can normally see you. Yeah, so I play uh, all over the area. I uh, was two, time on, two times on American Idol, got to play with Keith Urban. And, uh, but yeah, no, you can usually see me, Lakes Country, all over the place from here to California. Awesome. And we were just talking in the break. Her and I have an awesome connection. <laughs> she has performed with the first concert I ever went to. It wasn't that concert, but the same artist. Just talk about uh, who you've sang with. Yes, I've sang with, um, you know, Neil McCoy. That's where our that, connection that's is. That's the connection there. Yeah, yeah it's excited to always when I get to see him. And um, Lone Star, Confederate Railroad, Black Hawk, Jake Owen. So a bunch of like, you know, older country, but also some, some newer ones. So it's been awesome. And is someone here performing at WeFest? You right yes, there? Yes, this year. First okay. year ever. So excited. Yeah, do you know what day you're going to be there? Yes, we are there the Friday. I believe it's August 5th. Friday, August 5th. Yes, okay, so, so you can, come out. <laughs> yeah, so you're on the big stage. And how about you? You also have some, uh, you have an impressive resume already for a 15-year-old. Well, this summer I was really lucky because I got to be on the New York Today show. Um, and when I was 11, I was able to sing for Joe Biden. And um, this September, I got to open up for Sarah Evans, which was really fun. That is awesome. Thank you. You've done more in 15 years than I have <laughs> already. Yeah. And I like how she had to preface the, the Today Show in New York, not North Dakota <laughs> today, not the one in Fargo, but the one with like Hoda Kotb and all that sort of good stuff. Uh, and so just uh, going to you here, what is it like to be able to perform and see the people appreciate your music? the best feeling on earth like the the adrenaline you get when you're on stage and you know sharing not like I said not just other people's but your own because that's a huge part of your heart and like for me it's like my my journal that I'm just sharing to everyone and it's it's such a humbling feeling and Zach why do you stay in this why do you keep doing it I have no idea to be honest <laughs> uh no it's just it's something that's in your blood you the connection that you get when you're playing an original song and you see somebody that's like, you know, make eye contact with them and they, they relate to it. That, that's that feeling that kind of keeps you going through it. No, it's awesome. And I do want to clarify, you'll be performing originals at the Grand Old Brewery, correct? That's kind yep, of the, Yep, yep, all originals. Yeah. All originals, yes. Yeah. So just so people know that. Well, we are going to get a little sampling of what they're going to be doing after the break. So we have to take a quick break, but stay with us right here. We have some amazing country music coming up right after this.